welcome to a new video. Today I will be showing you my finished and furnished apartment tour. Three months ago my husband and I moved to Dallas, Texas and I also made an empty apartment tour video when we just moved in. I will link that down below. If you see anything in my home that you like there is a big chance I have linked that down below as well so you can buy it for yourself. Keep in mind that we tried to keep this apartment pretty minimalistic because when we moved out of our home in the Netherlands, we found out that we held on to quite a lot of stuff that we didn't actually need. So we didn't want to make that same mistake. So we didn't want to buy too much stuff to put in this house. We also kept the budget very low because we don't know how long we will be living here since we are probably only in Dallas or America for a few years. So many of the things you see today are either from Amazon, Ikea or Nebraska Furniture Market. Of course there are also some things from other home stores like Crate & Barrel or CB2 but overall we did keep the budget pretty low. I do think we still have a pretty nice home. If you like this video please hit the thumbs up button and the subscribe button because that really helps me out in the algorithm and let's get into the tour. So this is where we enter the home. You might remember this from our empty apartment tour and then right on our left we have a laundry room with the double doors. And the washer and dryer were already in it, but all the other stuff... Oh, and also this um, shelf thing was already there, but all the other stuff we bought ourselves. So we have some suitcases here because we don't have any other storage area for that. Of course, like laundry stuff over here. Some clothes that are hanging out to dry. And then more suitcases. And some emergency water. And yeah, this is just a pretty boring room, but oh, and of course, vacuum cleaner. This is a pretty boring room, but it is really nice to have as it is pretty spacious and it's just one of those rooms where you can put pretty much anything that you don't want your guests to see. Then on the right, like after you come in, there is this mud room. It was already like this as well when we first came here, but of course now we have some shoes here, some grocery bags, um, some jackets, and in here up top are some um, like hats and stuff, maybe some umbrellas as well. Then we walk into the kitchen area. We bought these chairs from an online store. I don't remember which one. And this is um, the area where I often work. And this is also where we eat. Then we got a little like fruit basket that now only has avocados. <laughs> We have some adapters here and some hand sanitizer, which is really nice when you come in. And then this fridge and the whole kitchen was also already here when we moved in. But of course now there is like <laughs> food in our fridge, although it's not that much because we eat out a lot. Also my Starbucks that I got this morning and haven't finished and some salmon we will be eating tonight. Then we bought those cutting boards, I think. And of course we have a Nutribullet right there, then a kettle. Um, we still need to have something to put our kitchen towels on. And we of course also bought some kitchen supplies that is really nice. We can hang it here. We got one of those little strainer things because we are scared of the grinder. <laughs> Um, of course some hand soap that's supposed to be right here and we got an espresso coffee machine which is very necessary I don't think I'm going to show you all the cabinets but I do want to show you our um, plates which is a really nice green color all this stuff is from Ikea then we have some, wait, this is interesting as well, our toaster, which is a very American thing. So I like having one now that we live in America. We didn't have that at home. Then this is like some glasses and stuff, like bottles and things for coffee. 
and this is where we keep some condiments like spices and stuff our Nespresso coffee we don't have a nice like holder thing for that yet and of course the collagen peptides that I put in my coffee then we put some wine in the fridge I think we only have one bottle now which is I think a uh, Piper champagne and then we walk on to what is this called like more our home area I will show you from the other side otherwise you can see my view and I don't like that so this is where we like watch TV and sometimes eat as well um, the couch we wanted a teddy couch actually but then we decided that that was maybe like more a trend thing so we decided to go with something that might last a little bit longer so it's still a boucle type of fabric just not teddy it is from Nebraska furniture market as well as the table and then the carpet the rug is from Ikea then this television stand is also from Ikea we still have to put some decorative stuff in here the cabinets are empty as well um, our television is Samsung I think we ordered it online somewhere and then yeah this is it needs a little bit more spice but we will get to that later then this is our little like liquor cabinet area which was also already here when we moved in some camera gear over here but we are probably going to put some green wall stuff over here so it looks a little bit more interesting or maybe just like a painting or yeah we we're not sure yet um, then this is the plant we do already have uh, which makes it feel a lot more homey and then here is still an empty wall which will probably need some art and then this is Mitchell's um, like desk working desk it's uh, you can either stand up or sit down um, he does both he also has a mic for his calls I think <laughs> and then of course his monitor and everything right now he still uses one of those bar stools chairs things to <laughs> sit on when he works but um, we are still getting a desk chair for him right there um, then we move to the bathroom in the hallway sort of there was already this cabinet but we put some books there and this painting that I got from my friend that says best friends which is really cute and also makes it feel a lot more homey then this is the bedroom um, that mirror over there is from Amazon I will link that down below over here is a little bit of an empty area but we decided to not do anything with that yet because we kind of like the minimalism in this room this bed is from Ikea um, we have a telephone charger over there um, and the bedding is Ikea as well it is like half satin or something but it is really nice I thought of putting some cabinets over here as well or what are they called nightstands um, but we don't really feel like we need them right now we just put like a bottle of water and our slippers there on the floor and it works fine but we might still get them later we have also thought of thought of some art maybe over there or on this wall but right now we like I said like the minimalism and there is our fan which we really really need as it gets hot in the night as well then we enter the bathroom with the double sinks as you can see probably this is Mitchell's area we both have a basket like this to put all our like loose stuff in and that part is my part then we have bought these little towels for on the side and these little rugs for on the floor and of course all of our toiletry stuff wasn't there either when we moved in um, other than that this space is pretty much the same as when we moved in 
Um, and then we enter our closet, which is double door as well. It is still kind of messy. I don't really know how other people do this, but I feel like we try to organize it with the baskets and stuff, but still it is pretty messy. But as you can see, this is my area. Um, not much to say about that. And then this is Mitchell's area as well. And of course we brought a lot of the clothes that we already had from the Netherlands, but we bought this laundry basket online as well. I can link that down below as well. And then these baskets are from Ikea. And our hangers are from Ikea as well. I have the white ones and Mitchell has the plastic black ones. Weird enough, we have different taste in hangers. <laughs> so this was the closet. And then we walk back to the living area and I can give you like a little overview. Overall, I really love our house. It is so spacious, even though it is a lot smaller than our like previous house in the Netherlands. I really like the light and cream colors. We had more color in our old home in the Netherlands, but now we kind of decided on cream and some metal, like silver metal, because this house has already kind of a lot of wood. For example, the kitchen and the floors. So that is why we wanted to keep the rest pretty simple. And yeah, I kind of like this vibe. The only thing is that it's pretty hard to keep clean. I also self tan a lot, so I do have to watch out a little um, and not stain all the white colors we have. But yeah, overall, I really love our house. And yeah, this is it. So this was my finished apartment tour. I hope you enjoyed seeing my home and all the stuff in it. I also have some videos on other apartment tours that we did before we decided on this apartment. And I have more content on living in Dallas and Texas as well. So be sure to check them out. And thanks for watching. I hope to see you next time. Bye.